Let's start things off by answering an important question. What is views? The views module allows you to query your content and display it as a list. And the list that it generates can be rendered through a page or a block. And you can even create a table using the views module. It comes with Drupal, so you won't have to download any extra modules and it'll automatically be installed if you installed Drupal using the standard installation profile. A lot of pages in Drupal are built using views. So click on structure and you should see this views link down at the bottom. If you can't see it, then make sure that the views UI module is installed. So let's go to extend and you wanna make sure that this views UI module has been installed if you cannot see that views link. Click on views and from this page, you can see all of the enabled views up the top and the disabled ones down at the bottom. A lot of pages in Drupal's backend are built using views. If you go to the content page, this page has been built using the views module. And if you click on comments, this is where you moderate all of the incoming comments. This is built using views. If you click on files, again, this is built using the views module. And if you click on the people link, from here you can manage all your users. Again, this is built using views. And if we go to the front end, this default front page is built using the views module. And if we click on one of these tags, which is a taxonomy term, this taxonomy listing page is also built by views. So as you can see, the views module is used everywhere in Drupal.